If you're looking for the best DVD player, here's a list you must see. We made this list based on our personal preference and sorted it based on their features, prices, quality, durability, and reputation of the manufacturers and customer feedback. Also, we've included options for every type of customer. So let's get started. At the first position of our list, we have Sony DVPSR 210 PDVD player. This affordable player can play multi-format DVD as well as CD. It supports fast and slow playback with sound, forward and rewind, instant replay, and disc resume. You can also use it to show a picture slideshow in JPEG and even add an MP3 background music. The unit itself is sturdy and ultra compact. The remote can sync with multiple brands and control TV functions as well. There are no HDMI ports on the device, so it is not compatible with a smart TV unless it has component or RCA connections. There is no display on the front of the player and minimal bumps on the device. Most functions need to be accessed by the remote, so make sure you never lose it. People who want an affordably priced DVD player that works with older TV. Moving on to the next at number two with Sony UBPX 704K Ultra HD Home Theater Streaming Blu-ray Player. The Sony UBPX 704K Ultra HD is built in Wi-Fi that allows you to access apps like Netflix, YouTube, Amazon Prime, and more. It will play just about any disc you can throw at it, including music in multiple formats. And it sounds fantastic with its high-res audio. It supports Dolby Atmos and Dolby Vision and has 3D playback. This player has two HDMI outputs, which allows you to separate your audio and visual for more precise sound. The one-year warranty gives you peace of mind in case anything goes wrong. While it does support the major streaming apps, the rest of the apps it offers are relatively limited. It is not explained clearly, but when you initially set up the DVD player, you will need to turn on Dolby Vision in the menu. It will stay on after the initial setup, but does not automatically come with it enabled. It has a lag when trying to get a movie started. It takes quite a bit of time when comparing it to streaming devices. There are some issues with freezing, especially with 4K. The only solution is unplugging it and plugging it back in. Someone who wants a good playback quality and understands it won't set up as quickly as streaming. The number three position is held by Panasonic Dolby Sound 1000 A-Dype USB DVD player. This player will upgrade your DVD video into Full HD with 1000 A-Dype, which makes it a great option for those who are using it specifically for DVD playback. Combined with Dolby Digital Sound, it has high quality picture and sound. It is also compatible with USB memory devices, though only for audio and JPEG, no video is supported. Very fragile, the Panasonic DVD player is not very sturdy and feels cheaply made. You should handle it with care when opening and closing the disk drive and when removing the DVD from the tray. This is not a good option for kids. The remote is small, the buttons are close together, and sometimes you need to hit the butt multiple times before it works. Next at number 4, we have Panasonic 4K Ultra HD Blu-ray Player. The Panasonic 4K Ultra supports 4K slash HDR, HDR10+, HDR10, and Hybrid Log Gamma. You can even get 4K streaming for VOD apps like Netflix, YouTube, and Amazon Prime Video. It has a powerful Panasonic HCX processor, which gives you sharp detail and beautiful color. They couple this display with high-res Studio Master Sound from DSD, providing a theater-like experience. It is Alexa and Google Assistant enabled. However, you must already have an Amazon Echo or Google Home device for it to work through. It does not house an Alexa or Google speaker. The device is a digital display and a USB input, making it competitive with others in the same price range. The initial setup of the DVD player is not intuitive for the user, and the Alexa and Google Assistant is tricky to set up. The interface for streaming is sluggish, with limited apps to choose from. A note of caution to parents, disable the after hours content. If you don't go in to specifically disable it, it will explain how to turn it on when selected. The number five position is held by LG Bpone 175 Blu-ray DVD player. LG packs a lot into this affordable DVD player, including DVD upscaling to 1080 dip via HDMI and Full HD 1080 dip for Blu-ray. If you want high-definition surround sound, LG includes DTS. DTS HD Master Audio, Dolby Digital, Dolby Digital Plus, 
and Dolby True HD. It also includes streaming apps like CinemaNow, Netflix, Pandora, Spotify, and YouTube. It is a wired device, not wireless, and comes with an Ethernet port to connect to. This can help increase streaming speeds, but it's a bit of an inconvenience that it's not a choice. There are only six apps available, so if you're looking to add more than the basics listed above, this isn't the machine for you. The number six position is dominated by LG Blu-ray player. The next level up for LG includes 4K Ultra HD UBD, Full HD 1000 ADAP, and 4K upscaling using the HDMI input. These features work with both 4K and non-4K TV. It's HDR10 and 3D compatible with Dolby Atmos and DTS HD Master. All that to say, it has amazing picture and sound quality. The LG is one of the only DVD players you can play back all of your USB content on. It supports USB and external HDD playback in 1000 ADIP or 4K upscaling. It's easy to switch between zones with a great interface and responsive remote, something not every device on this list can say. It has no Wi-Fi and is a wired device. Skip it if you are just buying it for the all regions aspect because it's very difficult to get it to play. Moving on to the next at number seven with LXCOM region free mini DVD player. LXCOM will play DVD, CDs, and U-Disc files in 1000 ADAP. It has a USB input, but limits what it will play back from a USB stick. It's a sturdy machine that reads discs quickly. The setup was nice and easy, and it has features like skip, slow motion, and advanced zoom. This machine doesn't play Blu-ray. So like the Jinu, it's best if you don't have Blu-ray disc that you want to watch. It's pretty low quality viewing, but if you're looking for something to just play your DVD on a regular TV and you want an affordable option, this is a great one. The number eight position is held by Pekka DVHP 9117 HDMI USB DVD player. LXCOM will play DVD, CDs, and U-Disc files in 1000 ADAC. It has a USB input, but limits what it will play back from a USB stick. It's a sturdy machine that reads discs quickly. The setup was nice and easy, and it has features like skip, slow motion, and advanced zoom. This machine doesn't play Blu-ray. So like the Jinu, it's best if you don't have Blu-ray disc that you want to watch. It's pretty low quality viewing, but if you're looking for something to just play your DVD on a regular TV and you want an affordable option, this is a great one. Next at number nine, we have Sony BDPS 3700 Blu-ray player. Sony's BDPS 3700 Blu-ray player is the opposite of our overall pick. The DVPS R510H, since it offers a complete home entertainment experience. As its name suggests, the BDPS 3700 Hundred can play both standard DVD and Blu-ray discs from all regions at 1000 ADAP resolution with upscaling and HDMI out, and it has Ethernet and Wi-Fi on board. When connected to the internet, Sony's high-end player can stream movies and shows from multiple services with a dedicated Netflix button right on the remote. An internet connection also enables the player to act as a game console through the PlayStation Now service. PS Now streams select titles without needing a disc, and you can pair compatible controllers directly to the player. Finally, the number 10 position is dominated by Rockville RVD10 HD GR10.1 flip down monitor DVD player. Available in three different finishes and flip down design, the Rockville RVD10 HD player is a seamless way to add DVD playback to larger vehicles. A large 10.1 inch LCD panel with a resolution of 1024 x 600 is great for extended road trips and it includes conveniences such as an IR remote control and an FM transmitter for headphones. Other highlights include a USB port and SD card slot for playback of local media, a disc that includes over 300 games, and an HDMI input. One of our favorite features though is that it also has built-in LED dome lighting just in case installation blocks existing lights and it also acts as mood lighting. That's all for today. We upload product review videos every single day. so. Don't forget to subscribe and hit the bell icon for the upcoming video notification.